Hello, this is Carol Lemke from BC Gurus, and this is part 5 of the modules series. In this video, we will focus on the Media Downloads module. The Media Downloads module is a module that lets visitors download media such as PDF files, Word documents, videos, and music. BC has created icons that represent each file type so you don't have to. We're going to be jumping into BC and going through how to set up media downloads. So, as a basic intro to what we will be covering, first off, how to create a media download, then how to customize the appearance of a media download, looking at customizing the list view, and then last, we will cover how to insert a media download. So how do we create a media download? Navigate to Modules, Media Downloads, here you will see a list of any existing media downloads you have, and you have a filter to refine your list. You can view all media downloads, view all enabled downloads, or view only disabled media downloads. There is also an alphabetical filter up top. To add a media download, click Add Media Download. On the next screen you will fill in details of that media item which include the name and the type. When you're all done, hit save. After you save it, you can then upload the media document. When you click upload, a pop-up will appear and you will click select to navigate to the file on your local computer. Once you have found it, select open and hit upload. If you open up more options, you can choose to enable or disable the file, add waiting, add a description, choose a release date, expiration date, and choose a role responsible which is a role who will be notified once the media file is set to expire. BC will let you customize the appearance of the media download. There is one view available and that is the list view. To edit the list layout, go to Site Manager, Module Templates, Media Download Layouts. Here you can edit the list view where you can specify how the link will appear and if you would like to include such things like a file type icon or file size information. Be sure to explore the tab insert drop down menu to customize your list layout for your media download. When you're all done hit save. When you are ready to insert a media download there are three ways of doing so. Within the media download view there will be an actions button with a drop down of options. Choose add media download to a web page. This will open up a pop-up where you will select what page to add this to. Click the insert drop-down and choose whether to insert only this media item, insert all media items, insert the latest media items, or insert all of them within a specific classification. When you're all done hit save and publish. The second way to insert media downloads is to use the module manager. Navigate to Media Downloads and choose Display List of Media Download Items. From here, you can choose to display from the following criteria. An individual item, all items, all items in a category classification, latest items, or individual random item. You will see a preview below and can click Insert to add it to the page. Click Update when you're done. The third way to insert media is to use the Custom Links drop-down menu. Navigate to Literature, another word for media, and choose which file to insert. It will insert the media download name in HTML with a link to the download. Click Update when you're done. Looking at this page, we can see how they were rendered. The first one was inserted via the Actions button from the media. The second one was inserted as an individual item from the Module Manager. And the last one was inserted with the custom links the custom links will display the media differently. It will just display the name as a link and it will not display what appears on the list template layout for media downloads. 